caught on camera, a Fort Bend County neighborhood on the lookout after several car break-ins. The crooks even managing to get away with one man's gun and ammo. We're talking about the Pecan Grove neighborhood in Fort Bend County. Channel 2's Brandon Walker live from there tonight with this story. Yes, yeah, see on that video you saw is from Wednesday night into Thursday morning. Cars broken into neighbors saying, though, that this has been going on for some time. So they hope that surveillance video that you're about to see again will put an end to that. They're just two guys that we have seen. Caught on camera, a daring caper. Bandits looking to swipe whatever they get their hands on. This one was open. This lid was open. Connolly Shepard's truck was broken into just last Thursday. My, my heart sunk, you know, and, and you know, I'm, I knew that something had happened and I looked at my console and, you know, my weapon was missing. Here's a picture of the stolen gun, a semi-automatic pistol. Shepard says thieves grabbed it, magazines. This was found over in the neighbor's yard on the lawn as another neighbor was walking by. And a box of ammo they apparently didn't want. The surveillance video is not from Shepard's home, rather a neighbor's that very night. In it, you can see one man walk up to a car, check to see if it's unlocked. He then moves over to a truck, uses a flashlight to see what's inside, then flashes light into a third vehicle before taking off. Shepard says he locked his truck the night it was broken into, but somehow that proved no match. Anger and, and, you know, feeling violated, you know, that somebody's taking something that, you know, worked hard for and, you know, is meant to protect me, and now, it, you know, it's not there, and I mean, it's just sick. Sickening, too, Shepard says, is the fact that neighbors in the Pecan Lake subdivision have complained of break-ins as well. You think it won't happen to you, and then it does, and it's just like, man, you know, if anybody's got any weapons in their car overnight, don't you know, bring them in with you in the evening because they're not going to do any good in your vehicle if you have them there. Uh, yeah, some sound advice there. Meantime, we can tell you that the Fort Bend County Sheriff's Office is investigating the case of that stolen gun. We're live tonight near Pecan Grove. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC Channel 2 News.